Former Asian International Arbitration Centre Chairman and Sundara Raju filed a suit against 11 people, including former Attorney General Tommy Thomas and former Malaysian Anti-Corruption Commission Chief Muhammad Shukri Abdul for misfeasance in public office and malicious prosecution. The former head of a regional arbitration centre also filed claims for false imprisonment, breach of his constitutional rights and conspiracy to injure through unlawful means. In the statement of claims cited by FMT, he said the incident led to loss of reputation, integrity, goodwill, liberty, dignity, and he endured mental suffering, humiliation, and anxiety. Sundra, who filed the suit in the High Court here yesterday through Messrs. Chok Engli Law Chambers, is asking 3.6 million ringgit in special damages and general aggravated and exemplary damages to be assessed by the court. He said the defendants were brought to notice that he was immune from any action. This was affirmed when the High Court held in December 2019 that removing his immunity would be against the 2013 Host Country Agreement signed between Putrajaya and the Asian African Legal Consultative Organization. It was also revealed that Wisma Putra had written to AALCO, the parent body of AIAC, to waive Sundra's immunity, but this was rejected by its Secretary General. On April 30th, a seven-member federal court bench chaired by Chief Justice Tengku Maimun Tuan Mat affirmed the ruling by the High Court.